A new development tonight in the search for four escaped inmates from the Tangipoa Parish Jail. Two have been recaptured. And it turns out that the inmates got out in two escapes from that jail, one on Saturday and one on Sunday. More on the search for the last two from WGNO's Jordan Lippincott. Monday morning, law enforcement officers in Tangipo Parish arrested two men who had escaped the parish jail in a meet over the weekend. They received a call that two people who fit the descriptions of the escapees were at the corner of Pumpkin Center Road and Old Baton Rouge Highway in Hammond. They uh, hid in a dumpster there uh, next to a store at that intersection and they were apprehended. Deputies are still searching for 19-year-old Omari on Hookfin, who was in jail on a homicide charge, and 20-year-old Jamarcus Cyprian, who's facing an armed robbery charge. Jimmy Travis, the chief of operations for the sheriff's office, says the second escape involving two of the men happened one day after the first escape. Jail personnel reportedly only learned about the first escape after the warden received a tip. Apparently they made their way, they hid, and then after dark, they went out under a wall and then they were able to scale two fences and, uh, and get away. And the, uh, yesterday we had the same, same thing happen. One man who lives near the jail says this isn't the first time an inmate has escaped. I think it could be in-house because it mostly happened on the weekends. Uh, I know I was sitting out barbecuing and the lady, she just run, you know, run, from, run straight through the gates and, you know, she escaped. And if it wasn't me, you know, me being outside, I was able to tell them, well, you know, what she was hiding at. Travis says the sheriff's office is taking accountability for the jail's shortfalls amid their ongoing search for the two escapees. It's a failure. You know, we had, we, we had a failure within uh, that we hope to correct. Jordan Lippincott, WGNO News. Chief Travis says he believes that the two inmates who are still on the run are no longer in Tangipahoe Parish. He also says that anyone who helps the escapees will be charged.